Hello guys and a very happy Christmas. This is my Christmas edition and through this video you will follow me on Christmas day when I travel to Switzerland. I will be travelling by train from Geneva through the Alps to Alton, a small town near the capital of Zurich. The reason I chose this country was because their public transport runs as normal on Christmas day unlike the majority of Europe and the UK and in fact they put on extra trains. Now let's get on to some facts about these places shall we? Geneva is a city in Switzerland that lies at the southern tip of Lake Geneva also known as Lac Liman. The city is surrounded by the Alps and Jura Mountains, whilst the city is also the home and headquarters of the United Nations and the Red Cross. Geneva actually has the longest wooden bench in the world. No, I'm not joking. Seriously, it's a thing. It is situated on the hill in the south of the old town and it was built in 1767 with 180 wooden boards. The World Wide Web was actually created in Geneva. In March 1989, Tim Berners-Lee, a scientist working at a research organisation called CERN, submitted a proposal to his boss about developing a new way of linking and sharing information over the internet. This is what has led to what we know today as the World Wide Web and started website developments all done in Geneva. In the summer, Geneva offers a free open-air cinema on the shores of the lake. Bring a picnic, sit down on a blanket or sunbed and relax whilst the movie is played. Oton is a town in the canton of Solifern and the capital of the district of the same name. It is located within a half hour train ride from the capital Zurich and is mainly a commuter town because of this. Okay, so there's not much things I could find out about Alton whilst researching, so I'll bring you something else a little bit exciting. In August 2020, there was an issue with the Lindt chocolate factory situated nearby the town, and residents were treated to an unexpected but delicious surprise. It began snowing chocolate, or should I say chocolate powder, and was the result of a malfunctioning ventilation system at the factory, and co combined with strong winds. Hello guys and happy Christmas to you at home. Yes, it's Christmas Day and guess what? I'm here chatting again. Christmas Day and uh, we're going to Switzerland. To be precise, we're going to Geneva, travelling around on the train. Quite a few hours that way before returning this evening back to here by a mail because it's Heathrow Terminal 5. Travelling with British Airways. I'll be back here at 8 o'clock this evening. Currently half four in the morning. And my flight departs at 6.50, so I've got a couple of hours here, and then I shall be on my way to Switzerland. Uh, I go to Switzerland every Christmas day. Simple reason is, their public transport don't stop. Yes, you heard me right. All their trains, they actually put on more trains on Christmas day than a normal Christmas day. And actually, it makes sense for me to go there because everything's there, shops are open and everything. Uh, so I go there for that particular reason. I shall join you after security here at Heathrow. The wonder 
Times are like got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy. Standing up close by the Christmas tree, glimmering light, I am right where I want to be. I'll be home for a couple of days, wander around with you. You and me in the cold, thought it'd never be true. Wherever I go, I got you. Oh, I have stopped running, there is no way trying. You better loosen your belts. Drinking up wine by the fire, don't care of anything else. It's Christmas, and some kind of love, my friend. Pray it will never end. Do you like to be here too? It's Christmas, and outside snow's glistening. It's just you and me tonight. I'll spend all this Christmas with you. Oh, it's such a charm. Uh, so I can't go so I'm back there for So, the plan for today is in half an hour time I'm guessing the train, interstate train from here to Alton uh, which is a small town uh, between here and Shook, the main capital uh, I'm going to get the train there, it's about two and a half hour train where I've got about 45 minutes there before heading back here, changing in Burn and we've got a bit of time to explore Burn as well So, without further ado, I shall leave you to enjoy we're done, I'll get back to you when I get to Oton. Well, I'm all for Christmas All the happy smiles and the wishes And I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe you're missing I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow whatever we do we will be all right these holiday wonders will open your mind may all your wishes tonight come true the love I live the dream I knew this Christmas I only want Close to you Magical time full of kisses Take a walk outside and tickle the snowman's nose Moving nimbly Did you hear something from the chimney? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow
views on the track, missed it. And it was just my lap. I sat on the wrong side of the train, then I moved across to the other side. There was no more views. Uh, but I did try to get a little cycle for you guys at home. But um, yeah. we have half an hour, just over half an hour here in Ogden to the floor. And then we are going to Bern, 10 minutes to Japan, and then got back to the airport. Half an hour from here to Bern. Join you later.
you guys are now back in Geneva Airport where I first started this morning. Um, now it's 4pm uh, and my flight starts at 5.40 this evening and I'm back into London Heathrow at 6.25 or earlier if the flight's all on time because at the moment it's scheduled to be on time. So I've got about an hour and a half here uh, at Geneva de Lach, decorated the airport quite well with Christmas decorations. Um, I shall do some videos and you'll see that later on. Uh, but yeah, I'll switch on when I get back to London. Well, I'm all for Christmas. All the happy smiles and the wishes. And I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe. you're missing I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow So, I hope you liked the video and my adventure around Switzerland. Now it's time to put my maths brain on and do some calculations and see how much it all costed. Bearing in mind it is Christmas Day, so everything was more expensive than usual. Firstly, the return flight cost, which was booked directly with British Airways, it costed £126.28, or translated into £126 Swiss francs. Then the food and drink whilst in the UK cost a total of twenty pounds and sixty three pence or twenty two point zero six Swiss francs. This included my sixteen pound sixty five on full English breakfast at Reverspoons. Now, the snacks and drinks whilst in Switzerland costed me £25.36 or 27.12 Swiss francs. Also, not forgetting my Uber, I had to get to the airport due to it being Christmas Day and still works out cheaper than Heathrow's parking. That costed me £42.26 or 45.19 Swiss francs in total for both ways, so not bad considering the day. The outward train journey direct intercity from Geneva Airport to Alton costed me a ripping £71.95 or 77 Swiss francs. The return journey by train from Alton to Geneva Airport changing at Bern costed £50.64 or 54.20 Swiss francs. So, how much did it cost me all together? Let's have a look. It costed a grand total of £337.12. And that seems like a lot, but the bulk of it was the flights and also the train journey because of it being Christmas Day, understandably. Anyway, I hope you liked my video today. And don't forget to like, subscribe and also hit that notification button so you don't miss any of my uploads. Until next time, safe travels and see you soon.